back over here, guys. It's time for another top five. Top five. Finally, I'm going back to it for top five worst video games of all time. Let's do it. All right. So, um, number five, I'm going to have to go with Shaq Fu. It's basically a fighting game with one of the greatest basketball players of all time, but they made his popularity go down even more making this crappy video game. I heard they're making a remake of Shaq Fu. Do people have so much money they don't know what to do with it? I mean, do people have so much money they don't know what to do with it? I don't know, but whatever. So, oh, okay, so here we go. Um, Number four. Aquaman Battle for Atlantis. The 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 un, the unwanted stepchild of the Justice League, they're making him even even hated even more with this with this crappy video game. Aquaman Battle for Atlantis is just if you wanna explore, you can't. There are invisible walls everywhere, there's there's Crappy fighting scenes. It's basically the same thing over and over again. And, um, yeah, that, yeah, whatever. Watch this move on there. Number three. Big Vigs over the road racing. I gotta say, that is one of the worst video games of all time. You can, there's not, out. sometimes it depends on your game. Sometimes you, the, the, your opponent, you, the, I guess the object of the game is the, Deliver a legal cargo escapee from the police. No legal cargo is strapped to the back of the truck. And no, no police. Anyway, just a race to the finish. And depending on what game you have, the opposing truck won't even move or will stop before the finish line. And when... And when you finish, you're a winner. You're a winner. R really? R and you, and if you ever, if you ever bought this stupid crappy game, the the time at the 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 top left hand screen means nothing in the game. It even goes outside the box it's even supposed to be in. And also, and also like, one last thing, you can go faster backwards than forwards. Okay, let's move on. Um, number two, E3. The, the 1982 cr crash of well, the crash of 1982, it was just awful. E.T. I just can't. It's just basically there's pieces of a alien telephone where E.T. has to contact his home planet and E.T. can ever, ever he can I guess he can I guess hovercraft it up or fly when he stretches his neck. Yeah. The the word the word video game in my opinion is Superman sixty four. Yeah, yeah, it's the one of the worst games of all time. It basically fly through rings, get a challenge, fly through more rings, get a challenge. You know what I mean. So um, and also you got you have to be a speed reader to read. To read the text of the directions. You have to be a speed reader. It's only there for like, whoop, whoop, just like that. It's just gone. And you're like, what the crap am I doing? All right. Yeah, so basically it's one of the worst games of all time. And I haven't played it. I don't want to play it. Whatever. But that's going to be it for this video. And see you tomorrow. Bye. And that was the top five worst video games of all time. And sorry for the the the, the tongue twisters. My my voice my 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 brain isn't working right today. I guess, but whatever. Bye. And I just want to say 
school is starting. I'm not going to be posting um, starting September 7th. No, it's September 8th that my school starts, and I'm not going to be posting as much. I'm probably only going to be posting maybe maybe weekends, maybe um, when I get home from school. I don't know, but um, whatever. That's going to be it for this video. See you in the next one. Bye-bye. I know this is, um, I know the background's weird. I'm at my grandma and grandpa's house. Just let you know, and bye!